got God. I've got God. I've got God. We should be happier. We're gonna play something. Read something. You should be happier. Hi, Josh Yada here. Thank you for giving me your trust and some of your time to see this new piece. In this video, I want to refresh you on how to update to the latest release of Ubuntu. First of all, let's check the release of this Ubuntu. And we check it using the terminal. Yes. One thing to do is to add terminal to favorites. That means terminal will always appear here on the tax bar. Once you have opened terminal, just right click it and you should see add to favorites. So click to add. It will show here that terminal has been added to your favorite. You can do so to any app. You can do so to any app you want to add to favorite. You can just open it, right click and add to terminal. So let's check the version of our Ubuntu. LSB underscore release dash A and press enter. See, we have 22.04. Now, before you upgrade to the latest, you need to do this. Search for software update. This one, click this. Once this software update opens, click updates and make sure that notify me of a new release version. Make sure that for any is is the option to pick. There is option for never, there is option for long term support versions. Make sure you click for any. Does. Does that. You want to double check this change that you made in the software and update. You double check that. You need to verify that you should type Vim or any editor you have on your Ubuntu. The editor I have is Vim. So you should type Vim or the name of your editor. It could be the inbuilt editor, which is nano. Type nano here slash etc slash update dash manager slash release dash upgrades and press enter. See this prompt 
it should show normal if it doesn't show normal press i if you want to type anything on the vim editor you should press i which stands for insert so press i and change this to and change it to normal make sure that this prompt is set to normal and press the escape and press shift and column key exclamation mark yes now let's double check it again let's run that command vim or nano slash etc slash update dash manager slash release dash upgrade see normal is there so we just now to upgrade to the latest release of ubuntu we use admin privilege which is sudo do dash release dash upgrade space dash c and press enter see he says he's checking for a new ubuntu release and he says a new release 22.10 is available so we and it tells us what what command to run to upgrade to the new release so we do do dash release dash upgrade and we press enter we say yes we just press y on the terminal and press enter If you've already upgraded to the latest release, what do you think of the release? Here it tells us to press enter, so we press that. We press Y on the keyboard and press enter. We press continue. We press enter again to continue. There's a notice here that this might take a while. As, as recommended, you need to plug your computer to power whenever you do an upgrade or update because you don't you are not so sure how long it will take to upgrade it and if your battery runs out as you do the upgrade it may damage your your system so always connect your computer to to power whenever you do an upgrade
I try to keep tapping the the desktop so that my computer doesn't go to sleep. So we are just going to type N, which is no. We need to restart after all this we have to restart for the chain to effect. So when you upgrade on a Linux, what actually happens is a new package coming to replace an, all the older packages because everything in Linux is a file. So all the packages have to be removed for the new packages to to stay and here it says 105 packages are going to be removed removing the packages can take several hours or click we say yes
and here it says to finish the upgrade a restart is required and we have to type y and press enter for the computer to restart Let's open terminal from lsd underscore release space dash a. See that the release is twenty two point one zero. Kinetic, that's the code name. See, so the update was successful. See, we have new background pictures and all that, which we are not in the older versions see the this is all this is new too before this wasn't showing this when you click to check the network and all that this was not there before in the next video i will go over what this ubuntu 22.10 is let me know if you successfully upgraded to this latest ubuntu and any other helpful tip from you i will appreciate I thank you. Please consider subscribing. Thank you sincerely for your trust and your time. See you in another such helpful video.